so today uh, in this lecture i am going to cover business process execution language and today i am recording uh, the part first of this particular topic business process execution language and today i am going to cover the history of business process execution language generally this business process execution language is used in orchestration phase and this orchestration phase is again available we have already covered the topic called web service design so in web service design we know that web service design is divided into five different phases five different steps the first step is uh, compose soa then second step designing entity centric business service third step designing application services fourth step designing task centric business service and the last step is designing business process out of these five different phases the business process execution language is used at the time of phase number 5 design business process so at the time of designing business process business process execution logic is used at uh, this particular language is used for choreographing the web services so web service choreography is again managed or that code is written with the help of web service business process execution language so let us uh, see some history of business process execution language so today i am just covering the history part and in my next lecture i am covering uh, the different tags used in business process execution language so business process execution language is similar to html language so similar to html here also the tags are again used so that tags are again i am covering in my next lecture in part 2 video so today i am recording the past part 1 video so let us start uh, the history regarding business process execution language so before we can designing the orchestration layer so orchestration layer is again designed in the step number 5 designing business process so before we design the uh, orchestration layer we need to acquire the good understanding so you should know uh, the understanding of business process execution language because this language is used in case of writing the orchestration layer in orchestration layer we are writing the uh logic for this orchestration layer and orchestration layer controls the web service operation one web service perform multiple operation and these operations are again managed with the help of orchestration layer and this orchestration layer logic is written with the help of business process execution language so this business process execution language is used to demonstrate how process language uh, process logic can be described as a part of concrete definition of uh, definition and that can be implemented and executed via orchestration engine so with the help of orchestration engine with the help of orchestration layer the web service operations are again controlled and for that you required process logic and to write the process logic uh, the developer used business process execution language so here i am showing you a common web service business execute uh, business process execution language process definition structure different tags are again used uh, for describing the business process execution language and these tags are process uh, start process end partner link start partner link tab end 
वेरिएबल टैग स्टार्ट वेरिएबल टैग एंड इफ द फॉल्ट और एरर ऑकर्स देन फॉर दैट टू कंट्रोल दैट फॉल्ट हैंडलर स्टार्ट फॉल्ट हैंडलर एंड अगेन हियर वी आर यूजिंग द सिक्वेंस टैग एंड इन सिक्वेंस टैग वी आर यूजिंग थ्री डिफरेंट सब टैग सो रिसीव इन वोक एंड रिप्लाई सो रिसीव इन वोक एंड रिप्लाई so in my next lecture i am explaining each and every tag used in business process execution language so process tag partner link tag variable tag fault handler tag sequence tag and in sequence receive invoke and reply these elements are again used so these elements and tags are again i am covering in my next lecture so uh, today we are just covering the history of business process execution language although you likely will be using the process modeling tool so most of the time the instead of writing the code the developers or service architect use different tools and this tool or uh, automatically generate the code so although you likely will be using a process modeling tool and will therefore not be required to author your process definition from the scratch a knowledge of web service business process execution language elements or tag still be useful and often required so nowadays the process modeling tool provide you a ready made structure of a web service business process execution language elements but if you know the knowledge uh, if you know you, if you are having the knowledge of web service business process execution language elements still it is useful and oftenly required by the developer so this business process execution language uh, modeling tool frequently make the references to these elements so this tools includes the elements provided by business process execution language that element we have already seen process tag start process element start uh, process end partner link tag uh, element start element end variable start variable end fault handler start fault handler end sequence start sequence end so web service uh, business process execution language modeling the tool frequently make the references of these elements and construct while writing the uh, or refining the uh the processes web services or the source code so this particular language is required to dig into the source code uh they produce to make further refinement so before we get into uh, the details of business process execution language and language elements first uh, in this particular video i am um, uh briefly discussing how this specification came to be the history related with business process execution language so here i have used one word business process execution language four is represented for four web services so initially the name of business process execution language was a uh, business process execution language for for web services and that for 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 represented by the number 4 therefore the short form of business process execution language for web service is written like this business bpel 4 ws was first conceived in july 2002 so this business process execution language for web service 
is first conceived in July 2002 with the release of uh, version number one uh, specification. And this particular language is released. That version number one is released jointly by three different organizations. And these three different organizations are again the giants: IBM, Microsoft, and BEA. so initially these three different organization they came together and they published the first version of business process execution language for web services in the month july 2002 then some modifications are again made so this document is proposed an orchestration language inspired by the very uh, previous variation such as so ibm is again using his own language so ibm using ibm web service flow language and microsoft uses microsoft x language specification to write the orchestration code so to write the orchestration code they use so initially uh, this document is again proposed by orchestration la logic uh, orchestration language and this language is again inspired by previous variation so initially ibm used his own uh, language web service flow language for writing the orchestration uh, logic and microsoft used x language for writing the orchestration logic so they proposed an orchestration language uh, uh, ibm proposes uh, web service flow language and microsoft uh, proposes x language specification and then jointed by the other contributor from sap and cbel system they came up with version number 1.1 of business process execution language for the web service and they release that specification and the release number is given as 1.1 and then um, they publish this particular release in the year uh, in may 2003 so this version received more attention and the vendor support as compared to version number 1 and uh, 1.1 is again uh, popular uh, in uh, 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 popular as a complaint orchestration engine so just prior to the release of business process execution language for web service specification uh, this uh, version means uh, they, uh, they submitted this version to oasis o a s i s is a technical community uh, committee so they presented uh, the specification before this o a s i s oasis technical committee again they developed the official open standard so this particular uh, version is again uh, the release is again kept before the uh, this particular oasis technical committee and then uh, this particular the full form of this oasis is what organization for the advancement and structured information standard so this particular organization developed the official open standard so it's a open standard language uh, anybody can use so this is what the history related with business process execution language in my next uh, uh, lecture i am going to cover the elements of business process execution language so today i am covering this much only